hello everyone in this video i would like to share with you the instructions for final assessment for the paper ksg 3603 ethics so as we have agreed before we will um, conduct or we'll sit for the final assessment on the 7th february 2022 on monday okay so at 8 a.m you will receive three documents firstly you will receive the question paper that will be saved as a pdf format second you will have a declaration form declaration form is a form that you need to submit acknowledging your work you have to inform the it's kind of like a, a document that they inform um, us or the university that the work that you submit is solely by you it's being done by you okay so it's a pretty legal document eh? so anything goes wrong we will use this against you okay so please be careful therefore do not copy do not discuss uh, your answers okay do not ask somebody else to write the answers for you next is you will be given a link link to google drive okay so link to google form okay in this form what we will uh, what i will give you is uh, a slot for you to um, submit your answers okay just like how you submit your assignments you will be given um, sections where you have to upload your answer scripts Okay, all these three things, the question paper, declaration form and the Google form will be shared directly in our WhatsApp group, okay, in our Teams WhatsApp group. Also will be, everything will be put in a Google Drive as well. Okay, so I'll create a folder called Final Assessment. All the documents, declaration form question paper and the link to the google form will be posted in the google drive okay so i'll give you the link to the google drive also i will post all these three information on whatsapp as well so what you need to do okay you are required to download okay download the question paper and start answering it type your answers in a word document so you have to type your answers okay importantly every time you do a question one question one script okay one word document so if you are answering question one maybe you can have one um one one a okay or one b so type separately so for question one a one word document question one b one document okay then save the word document as question one underscore your last four digit numbers okay so uh, in this case mine is zero 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 seven so my last four digits from my metric id is zero 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 seven okay so question one underscore zero 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 seven okay i want to do it for my question b 1b so i will say question 1b underscore 0007 same applies to question 2 and so on after that you also have to download the declaration form okay this declaration form you need to fill out the form okay sign and uh, scan or take picture of uh, the completed declaration form and then um, you have to upload uh, you have to keep it first because you need to upload it later or what you can do is if you don't have scanner or anything or you don't have a printer never mind fill out the information okay the google uh, the declaration form fill up the form once you fill up you leave initials okay on the signature section you don't have to um, Maybe if you have digital signature, use a digital signature. If you don't have, you can just write your, uh, again, your name there or put initials. Like uh, maybe you can put um, PG, okay, or Priya G, 
uh, in my case okay i want to leave an initial i can put priya g okay a shorter version of your name or something like that okay these two are important one is your answer script another one is your declaration form so what do you need to do next so once you have completed all your questions once you have filled out your um, declaration form then submit them all through google form okay so you will be given a google uh, link form to upload all the documents so if you have four questions okay uh, you'll have like four slots to upload them okay and then you will have a, a slot to upload your declaration form so once uh, you have uploaded all the answer script along with the declaration form you click submit and you are done okay so um you are given time till on the same day monday till 11:59 so you are given more than 12 hours so from 8 a.m you are given time until 11:59 p.m so you have to finish everything with that particular day okay and only one submission is allowed so you have to be careful when submitting okay so you have to be very very careful okay i wish you all the very best and i'll see you guys on the 7th thank you